Hello, Jorge. Here is your Waltham, and it's ready to go. So, uh, you have uh, already entered the world of vintage watches. And I think this is for a friend, of, excuse me, a friend of yours. So, uh, he'll need to watch the video. And together, you guys uh, know pretty much everything I know about these old vintage watches. So, let's start with the first of all, you know that they're not waterproof. This is not waterproof. Don't wear it in the rain. Do not wear it in the rain. Do not let it take a chance of it getting wet inside. This has got a uh, Waltham Seaside movement in it. And it's uh, running very well. And so let's start with uh, the care on these. Uh, I, If you don't already own one, get yourself a rouge cloth from um, Amazon. And use it to clean all the fingerprints off the dial and the glass and everything in the back. And da, 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 da. I'll polish it before I stick it in the box. So, not a waterproof watch. We know that. So, winding. We're going to do the same. We wind all the other watches, which is in one direction only. Not back and forth. And in the forward direction. So, let's go ahead and do that now. I think this needs to be fully wound. It will take a full wind. So... There you go, tight. So then pinch behind the crown. Remember, we don't pull out. So we want more control on the crown because the setup is very much exactly like, very much like a pocket watch. So we want to preserve those materials in there that are doing their job. And this is the way you do it. So we'll pinch behind the crown. And we'll do it once, once more. Pinch behind the crown. Thank you. And then we want to move the hands in the forward direction only. Don't whip them around and set the time. And you are set. Gorgeous watch. And again, thank you very much.